All right, guys. So today we're gonna be working on a 2016 Jeep Liberty, uh, 2.4 liter. We're gonna do the spark plugs. Um, what you're gonna need is a T30. That's what holds down the ignition coil boots. There's one right here. I already took this one's off. I have that coil out. So I just easily with your T30, that's the one you need. Just start taking it off. Alright. There you go. This orange clip right here. Just push it back. There you go, like that. And then there's like a little thing right here. Push it down. And then it will come up. Sometimes you don't have to take it off because the whole thing will come together and you can just set it to the side. But then that's how you get the coil out. And inside there will be your spark plug. Um, make sure it's not cracked or anything because if it's cracked then that could cause a misfire. Make sure everything's good. Set it to the side. Alright, we good. Okay, now to get the spark plug off, you'll need a extension. I got a six inch and then a two inch with my uh, three eighths ratchet and my spark plug socket, five eighths. Just put it in, you'll feel it. And then just just break it loose. old one new ones right there I did all the other three I'm just showing you guys how to do one all the other ones are the same way so you need a T30 for this little screw that's right here holding down the coil boot your 5 8 uh, spark plug socket this one's magnetic so they won't fall in your extension your ratchet that's all you need now what I want you to do with your new spark plug Put some anisees right here on the threads, just a little bit, just like that. Like that's enough. Once you start threading it, it's all gonna get everywhere. Use some dielectric grease, put it on the tip right here. Just like that. Alright. Get your coil. Air coil, put some on the tip too as well. The electric grease on the coil. I'll just make a better electrical connection. And this is one thing where a lot of people mess up on. So put your spark plug in. Put it in your socket. You always, always want to start spark plug by hand. Never put a electric impact or the ratchet. Always want to start it by hand. Make sure you can feel when it grabs the. You you can feel when it starts turning. When it starts grabbing the the threads. You don't want to cross thread it. You don't want to break anything inside just makes your life way easier do it all the way by hand until you can't turn it right there I can't turn it anymore so that's when you grab your, your ratchet all right once you can, right away you can start feeling pressure on it because that's already tight not just do a little turn like that you don't want to go too much want to go way too much this is what a lot of people mess up on either they cross thread it or they don't do it tight enough or they do it too tight and then you end up messing 
all the threads down there and then you have to fix it all right so then just put it down put it down grab your little t30 screwdriver back in it's like a lock and that's how you do the spark works on a 2016 Jeep Liberty turn it on check for any misfires 